In this segment, we'll demonstrate Marionette's multi-person tracking feature. To begin, import a video file that contains multiple performers. Once loaded, go to the Calibrate button and select Segmentation Multi-Person to activate the multi-tracking mode. Before calibrating, now is a good time to set your in and out markers. This allows you to trim the clip and only process the specific part of the performance you need. Use the I and O hotkeys to set your range. This brings you to the Pick Frame screen. Marionette uses this single frame to identify each person in the shot. Scrub through the timeline and find a frame where all performers are clearly visible and separated as much as possible. Once you have a good frame, click Next. Marionette now automatically generates colored masks. If you notice a silhouette is broken or unclear, you can refine it. Select the performer's color and use the Add Points tool. When you place a marker on a body part, Marionette's AI will recognize its location and automatically place the corresponding joint. We'll repeat this process for all three performers to ensure each one is tracked correctly. With all performers defined, click Segment. Marionette will now process the video, tracking each person's silhouette. After this initial pass, you can scrub the timeline to confirm that the segmentation looks correct throughout the video. If you find any frames where a mask is broken, you can simply pause and add a new point to fix it. Once you've confirmed the masks are accurate, go to the Calibrate screen. Here, you'll select which performer to process first. The performer you select for calibration will set the ground plane for all animations, so it's best to choose someone standing firmly on the floor. We'll select the one in yellow and click Use this frame for calibration. Marionette will then create the final motion data for that take. After the final loading, the process is complete. In the project panel, you will now find a separate and independent animation take for each performer. You can select any of these clips and use the clean motion function to apply an automatic cleanup filter. And there you have it. The animation is now ready. From here, you can refine the motion further. Use the live preview with our supported plugins or export the animation as an FBX.